welcome. We're here with another product support series video for you for our MC Mag 2000. Uh, we're going to be showing you how to install our newest product. So here are the tools that we're going to be needing to get started. Pretty simple, pretty easy. We have our torque wrench, which we'll use on the U-bolt as we tighten it to the line. And we also have our Molly coat. Um, we reference this um, in our IOM so that you can put this onto the, the gasket underneath the saddle to help you get a really good seal. Uh, you're also going to want a hole saw if this is a brand new installation and not a retrofit um, for that three inch diameter cutout. Okay, so whenever you receive your MC Mag 2000, of course you'll have your MC Mag 2000 in the box, but you'll also have some other items in here as well. Um, you'll have some helpful documentation, both the IOM, the installation and operation manual, as well as a quick start guide to help you get through the installation quickly and easily. The other items you'll have in here will be your U-bolts. And of course those U-bolts will come with the washers and the nuts required. So this is your full setup to be able to install your new MC Mag 2000. Okay, and once you've unboxed your MC Mag 2000 um, and you're ready to install, if you're retrofitting because you had an MC prop in there prior, um, you've already got the cutout so you don't have any work to do at all there. However, if this is a brand new installation, uh, you're going to want to have a hole saw and you're going to want to cut a three inch diameter hole in order to get the sensor in. So you seat this exactly the same way that you would with an MC prop. You want to make sure that gasket has a nice molly coat lubrication on it or an equivalent um, that'll really help it get that seal on the pipe and then you're going to want to get your your u-bolts that were provided and we're going to go ahead and get these started put the washer first and then the nut on top and we're just going to hand tighten them for now before we get into the, the torquing procedure for installation. Okay, so you're going to want to grab your torque wrench and what you're going to want to do is make sure that as you tighten down the saddle, you're going to tighten them in a pattern. You're going to kind of do a, a crisscross or a figure eight pattern um, and that just makes sure that it gets well seated. We're going to do three rounds of this and the first round of this, uh, you're going to go to 40 um, foot pounds and then you'll go to 60 foot pounds and then you'll finally finish at about 80 foot pounds. So once you get it up to the 80 foot pounds and it's all well seated, you're good to go. You're ready to start flowing again and you can pressurize your line. Uh, thank you for joining us for another one of our episodes of our product support series. We've hope, we hope you found this informational. Um, if you enjoyed the video, please feel free to subscribe so you can find out whenever we come out with some more. Um, and if for more information on the MC Mag 2000, please feel free to visit our website at macrometer.com or you can check out our other YouTube uh, product videos on this product. Mm -hmm.